and the udara is not even mentioned. <laughs> so, uh, Putra International, uh, Putra Interlake International College still has got its uh, bearing, you know, right by paying tribute to the members of the security forces, armed forces and police alike. And I'm really deeply honored to share this stage together with prominent figures uh, such as uh, Professor Emeritus and uh, the like and all the learned uh, professors here, doctors, datus and tansris who have been the past recipients of this award. To be honest with you, if this is not God's will, uh, it's not anyone else. But the, the advantage of being the last speaker from the recipient, the lifetime achievement recipient is most of the points which I wanted to say has already been covered by the first two speakers. And, uh, but uh, it's about the dreams, you know. Uh, I think the Professor Emeritus, uh, uh, Dr. Shah Salim Faruqi, mentioned about, you know, you must dream in your life. Uh, it's very true in my life, you know. Uh, I, was the, I was the only son for my parents. And when I joined the Navy way back in 1973, I was the only child for my parents. So it's naturally, you know, uh, being the only son and also the only child, my parents didn't want me to join uh, the Navy, not because of anything else, because being uh, born for an Indian parent, being conservative, their parents, they say that when at old age, uh, there will be nobody to look after them, being, you know, the Indian family, being an extended family. So my, fa my father was saying that when you and when my, parent, my, my mother and my father were at old age, there will be nobody to look after the family and I don't know where will you will be in past part of the ocean, you will be patrolling and you will not be even be able to attend my funeral or your mom's funeral. And uh, you are the only son, you have to be around for all these uh, rites and customs and traditions. Uh, so he wanted to send me to India to do my medicine. And you know what I did? I ran away from home. <laughs> and uh, I dreamt ever since then, you know. I dreamt, and uh, not only our doctor mentioned just now, the Professor Emeritus mentioned, even the former president of India, Dr. Abdul Kalam, has mentioned that you all must dream. Dream, not the dream where you s dream when you're sleeping. You must, <laughs> you must dream when you're awake. Imagine that you have achieved uh, that particular whatever you want to be in your life. And that dream will throw a rope to you in this present future and drag you to that destiny. So destiny is all in your hands, ladies and gentlemen. So I dreamt, I was in, I was a schoolboy, that I will join the Navy.